Welcome back to my channel, you beautiful people. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. So, Certified Lover Boy, a.k.a. Drake, a.k.a. Aubrey Graham, and Rapper 21 Savage linked up and did like an album. A song from their joint album, it was called Her Lost, that was released Friday had social media in a frenzy. In the song Circo Loco, Drake raps about, now don't quote me wrong on the lyrics, but something about this B-I-T-C-H lie about getting shot, but she's still a stallion. That line sparked immediate backlash from listeners with many criticizing Drake for the obvious reference to Megan and for feeling the theory that she lied about the shooting that happened between her and Tori. Meg responded herself with a bunch of tweets and basically said that Drake is using her shooting for clout. I don't want to too much insert my opinions, but I don't understand why I don't understand why all these men are coming for Meg. Like, what did she do so bad? Where all these men come, coming for her. We had Tori with the shooting, the alleged shooting, uh, the baby coming out and saying that he slept with her the day she went to Tori, some stuff. Then we got her with uh, Carl Crawford, the, the record label, and, and, and Jay Prince, and now Drake. Like, what does she do? What does she do to these men? But I just want to see why I want to see why Drake brought up the incident, and I also want to see how Jay Z feel about it. Be, uh, about Drake mentioning Meg in the incident in this song because Jay Z had kind of weighed in on the drama surrounding Drake's um, little diss record, and y'all know that Meg is managed by Jay Z's company, Rock Nation. Jay Z Twitter account was caught liking and unliking a tweet from, I think he worked for BET, BET News host uh, Mark Lamont Hill, where Mark Lamont Hill basically defended Megan. Let's get into this reading. This reading is for entertainment purposes only, and it, it may not resonate with you all. Before we get started, I would like to say, you know, some people feel that my readings are hard to follow because. I don't say like, oh, Megan said this or, or Drake said that. I might say like one or someone or this person, that person. I do that because for legal purposes and I just don't want to put a name on a situation. So, you know, I'm, I'm sorry if it's hard for you to follow. But um, let's get started. Spirit, thank you. Please protect on me during this reading. Oh, let's first see how, let's see how Drake feel towards Megan. How does Aubrey Graham feel towards Megan the Stallion? Spirit, thank you. Please show me how does Robert Drake feel towards rapper Megan the Stallion? How does he feel? It's like she took something away from him. He's unhappy about a situation. You feel like she took something away from him. Hmm. Show me, Spirit. How does Drake feel towards Megan? Thank you, Spirit. <laughs> yeah. Disharmony. Something happened. He is salty about something that happened. Oh, we got the Eight of Swords. The Eight of Swords in reverse. The Eight of Swords in reverse indicate like a person who this person is unable to move forward and they, they unhappy about a situation. This person, they want they want what, what a past situation was once before. I feel like I feel like 
one is stuck in a grieving state and, and everything revolves around a loss. This person is like they unable to let go of something which is, is long overdue. They, they they focus on power and being in control. It's like they they are grieving over the fact that their their role is no longer needed. Like they feel like they being used or they was used. I feel like there was a, a conflict between one wanting to distance oneself and wanting to open up. Basically, conflict between saying no and saying yes. It's like someone found what's enjoyable and where happiness lies without this other person. They basically moved on away from this other person. Overall, one departed from one's comfort zone where they was comfortable with and they go where there's a lot of insecurity, unfamiliar conditions, and, and adventure. One left one situation and moved on to the next. They went on a discovery. It's like they, they left behind something they started out with. Okay, thank you, Spirit. Let's move on. Let's move on to these little song lyrics where Drake is basically calling Megan a liar about being shot. Spirit, why did Drake, why did he bring up that incident involving Megan and Tori in the song Circle Local? Why did Drake bring up that incident, Spirit? Why did he bring up that incident? He knew that that it would get attention, gain attraction. And it's also like, because he had all these other options, but he knew that one option was the best option for him. And I kind of also feel like he, he wanted to be a big shot, like show out for somebody. Why did he do it, Spirit? Why did he do it? Why did he bring up this incident? Knight of Cups in Reverse. <laughs> the Knight of Cups in Reverse indicate one is using their insights and their intuition to, to make others hurt. This person is, is they putting on a performance for others rather than being their true selves. They want to entertain It's like their one's emotions are are getting the better of them. This person feelings could be hurt due to due to them being rejected. Due to them being rejected. I I, I just feel like this person did it because they, they they being medicine. Because they they knew that the news would make a great impact. That news would travel. It would get people talking. This person is extremely dominant and pushy. I feel one wants to, they want to attack another person's happiness. Yeah, it's like this person is longing to do, do one's own thing, even if others don't agree with it. So they knew what the, they, others probably said, you know, this is not a good idea. But they went on and did it anyway. I, they they fully assessed the risk before they tackled crossing the threshold. They are well equipped for transformation, so they knew what they was doing. Overall, this was a plan to establish authority within a group that's seen as family. Yep, they want to look like the big shot in this group. <laughs> well, I was about to say gang, but yeah, they want to look like the big shot of this group. 
Okay. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you. Thank you. Let's see how Jay Z feel. Let's see how he feel about things. Because he was he was liking and unliking tweets. That's in favor of Meg. Spirit, please show me Jay Z feelings about Drake Circle Local Song. How does Jay Z feel about Drake Song Spirit? How does Jay Z feel about Drake's song? He feel like Drake. He could have used other words. He he could have. He could have did something else. Yeah. How does Jay Z feel about Drake? Local song, circle local song. How does Jay Z feel, Spirit? Thank you, Spirit. That it caused conflict. He feel like it, it caused a lot of conflict. Stirred up a lot of problems. The moon in reverse. The moon in reverse denotes someone who is lost in some kind of madness often due to not allowing their creative abilities to surface. I feel like one feels like another made a painful choice slash a painful indecision. They inflicted pain in insults on another person's body. It's like their, their behavior was abusive. The same person feel like the same person that inflicted, um, that made a painful choice, wants power or influence badly, and and they just moved reckless. They they moved reckless. They let other people influence influence them. Overall, one feel that another person made a decision. Uh, unemotionally and they, they need to take stock and discard what's unproductive. They feel like this person is drawn to an ideal because it makes them feel powerful or special. Basically, this person is doing everything to fulfill their, their heart's desires. to Basically, to fit in. They're doing everything to fit in. I also feel like um, this same person feels like another is being tricked and falling prey to another person's story. They, yep. Yeah, they, they feel like the story that the person is going by, um, the person that told them the story manipulated the facts. Thank you, Spirit. I'm still stuck on Drake feeling like Megan took something from him. I know there were rumors that they kind of messed around before. I was about to end this reading, but um, I want to see. I, I want to see why why he shamed her. Did they ever mess around? Yeah. Spirit, did Drake and Megan the Stallion, did they ever? A little rendezvous going on? Did they have a sexual experience together? Did Drake and Megan the Stallion have a sexual experience? Show me, Spirit. I don't think so. I don't think they did. He thought about it. <laughs> Did Drake and Megan Thee Stallion have a sexual experience? Spirit? Thank you, Spirit. Nope. I don't think they did. What we got here? <laughs> Nine of Cups in Reverse. Somebody is unhappy. The Nine of Cups in Reverse can represent wishes unfulfilled. A, a lack of achievement. Um... 
friendships fall apart due to lifestyle choices. Lifestyle choices. Um, we see all these cups on here. Overindulgence. Um, it, it could be overindulgence in food. Not only alcohol, but it could be overindulgence in food. And um, also substance. Pleasure turned into pain with the nine of cups in reverse. I feel there was like a very strong ambition and craving. And I feel like a person studied another person diligently. And it's like they they found out the truth about this person. Yeah, I feel there was manipulation of facts though about this person. I feel one they know a lot about another person and believed everything that they heard about this person. Their mind was easily led. Their mind was easily led. It's like this person following the leader. It's following someone else thinking process about another person. High school type of shit. Only with rapper. With male rappers. Let's link up. <laughs> I don't like you because I heard you did this and I heard you did that. They believe because they are loyal to this person that told them that. Yep, they they loyal to the person they getting the information from. So, yep. Let's get a message. Spirit, can we get a message? In regards to drink and begging, message in regards to drink and begging, message in regards to drink and begging, thank you spirit, wow spirit be knowing y'all, spirit be knowing, your commitment is being tested. Your commitment is being tested. In this situation, I'm going to say names. Megan. Uh, I know there are challenges you are going through. Challenges coming your way. But it's, it's just the universe way of testing you, Megan. Face these challenges. And face these hurdles with confidence. What you believe to be true is true for you. So believe in yourself. And just know your commitment is being tested. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I am going to... That conducts the reading, guys. I'm going to get things here. That conducts the reading on Drake and Megan. What do you guys think about this situation? Y'all know I love hearing y'all opinions because y'all say just the right stuff. Um, do y'all think Drake was wrong for throwing shade at Megan? Um, do you guys believe Drake when he says Meg lied about being injured? What do you guys believe? Leave your thoughts and opinions down below. I want to hear from you guys. I like hearing and seeing you guys' opinions. So leave them. And don't forget to hit the like button. Please hit that like button. Thank you all for watching. Be blessed.